Namaste, my beautiful women. I decided to record this video after a meditation that happened to me this morning high in the mountains. I climbed a high mountain where I performed my meditations, prayers for the world, and then the spirits came to me and I asked, spirits, what do people need to find true happiness? And the spirits showed me pictures of when children are offended by their parents. Parents are often offended by children and how dark spirits appear between them, tearing their hearts apart. Then the Spirit said, people should forgive each other. We must forgive and pray for each other. And today I want to tell you a story of my student. She was 40 years old. She said, I am in a difficult situation. I still can't forgive my mother. Many years ago she left me, and now I have a big pain in my heart. When this woman came, I saw that in the area of the lungs, she had a dark spirit in the area of the heart. This is a clot of dark energy in the aura. I looked and saw that she has problems with the bronchopulmonary system. She has heart problems because it is this dark essence that takes all the essentials, all the energy, I told her. When you forgive your mom, you won't have bronchial asthma. You won't have any heart problems. You will be healed. She looked at me very strangely and said, You shamans are strange people. I have been registered with a doctor for so many years. I drink a lot of medicines go to resorts, go to rest, go to resorts, go to rest, go to resorts, rest, go to resorts, rest and do fitness, but nothing helps. And you think I'll forgive her and everything will work out? When she left, I began to pray very much that this knowledge would reach her heart because this is excellent knowledge, forgiveness heals. The power of prayer, especially the prayer of shamans, is extreme. Literally, three days later, this woman called me and said, You know, I've been thinking about your words. At first, it caused me a lot of negative emotions. I started to get annoyed. How so? Why should I forgive her? After all, she left me and I spent my entire childhood alone. I didn't feel a mother's love. But then, as if some spirit begins to speak to me, darling, but she is just as unhappy as you are. And I sat down and started crying. I began to pray and ask for forgiveness. Then I remembered that I had a crystal that you picked up for me. I took it in my hand and started holding it and praying. Tears flowed from my eyes. If earlier I was suffocating, I couldn't even spend an hour without suffocating. Then I noticed that I breathed freely all day today. What have you done? And then I made a diagnosis. After all, I am a medium and I am a psychic. I see the subtle world. I saw this essence began to move away from her bronchi, lungs, her heart and leave. After a month, she had a lot of energy and spiritual strength to find her mother to come and tell her, I'm sorry, forgive me for judging you without knowing your life. And then mother started crying and saying, and you forgive me. As it turned out, her mother also had bronchial asthma for 40 years, so the woman could not heal. And now they have found the strength to forgive each other. Forgiveness is a great energy and it is a great healing power. Both women are now healthy. They have such a harmonious relationship. Finally, they could understand each other, forgive each other and find harmony in the family. And today, my dear, 
the spirits gave me a special sign so that I, with the help of my magic crystal of spiritual purity and forgiveness, would transmit to you the flow of the energy of forgiveness. Stretch your hand forward to the screen. Touch this crystal, which was brought from the special places in Tibet, from an ancient monastery. This crystal is several thousand years old. It heals with its purity. Put your hand in front of your eyes and imagine that person whom you cannot forgive, the thoughts of whom cause you, perhaps, tears, a feeling of resentment, and maybe even anger. Tune in. Take a breath from the crystal. Draw in the pure energy of love, forgiveness. Exhale and channel the energy of forgiveness through your other hand to this person and say out loud, or maybe to yourself, I forgive you, soul. Say it until this purity appears in your heart. Maybe tears will flow, and that's good. In this way, the heart is freed from the dark spirit that has bound all your love energy in your aura. Take a deep breath from the purest crystal. And with an exhalation, direct energy directly to this person's heart. I forgive you. Perhaps it's your parents, partner, children, colleagues at work. Do this practice using the power of this crystal. Listen to the sounds of cosmic transformation music. Feel how your heart is filled as if with life-giving moisture, with this energy of forgiveness. Inhale, I'm taking in purity. Exhale, I'm directing into the heart of the person I want to forgive. Inhale, exhale. Now take another deep breath, hold your breath, feel this flow of the purest crystal energy in your heart. Exhale. Direct the full depth of your feelings of forgiveness to this person, this soul. I forgive you, soul. Take another deep breath. Exhale. Feel how light your heart has become, how free and calm it has become. And this is just the beginning. The more you do this practice, the more often you do it, the more you will notice that your heart will be filled with love, Diseases of the heart, respiratory system will go away. A curvature of the spine in the thoracic area will go away. You will notice how much love will appear in your life. My dear, we do special forgiveness practices at our seminars because we understand perfectly well how important it is to heal people through forgiveness. Spirits always tell us how to do this in what places and what magical amulets to perform this ceremony and rituals so that life in the lineage becomes completely different. Come to our seminars. 
come to the places of power. We will be delighted to share the most ancient cosmic knowledge with you. You have gained new knowledge, and now it's time for you to become a ray of light to new people. Share this video with them. Invite them to become part of the field of love. Come with them to our classes and seminars. Help others, and God will help you.